Over the next couple of days, we're going to be very cold and very quiet. It's going to be Sunday into Monday that we're going to get some quick moving clipper systems that will spread some light snow across the area as we go Sunday and into Monday. Not a huge storm system, but a little bit of light snow in a month that has shown very little snowfall. Current wind chills. Yeah, they're brisk down into the lower teens and single digits, especially as we go through the evening and overnight. A little bit of light flurry activity shows up mainly east of I-75. We've got some light flurries and snow showers from Fremont to Oak Harbor out to Sandusky and Norwalk. It's a little steadier, more persistent toward Cleveland and some additional light snow showers are drifting off of southern Lake Michigan across north central and northeastern Indiana west of I-69. Generally, clouds will begin to clear out tonight. We'll get more sunshine that will will return for our Friday, but it still will be a cold day. Overnight lows tonight will head down close to 10 degrees. Highs tomorrow for a little brighter sun will reach toward 23 degrees. A little weak system brushes just to the north of us Saturday, so I do expect more cloud Saturday, but dry weather. And then a quick clipper Sunday that comes out of the northern plains will brush a little bit of light snow into the area Sunday. It's very quick moving, little if any accumulation. And as we get into Monday, perhaps a slightly better chance of a minor accumulation with this next clipper system that comes right in on the heels of that second one. And I do expect light snow chances into Monday. How much total? We'll give you an estimation on this because it's not going to be much. Around an inch total, some areas. If we get hit with both those clipper systems, could go slightly higher, but it is not anything that's going to have you reaching for the snow shovel. Speaking of that, do you even know where it is? With how little snow we've had through the month of January, less than a half an inch, and we're really in the running if perhaps we miss out on one of those clipper systems to be one of the least snowiest Januarys on record. In fact, only five years in our recorded history have we seen less than an inch of snowfall? Just a few flurries tonight. We'll get very cold down close to nine degrees tonight. Highs tomorrow going to reach toward 23 degrees. It's a cold Friday, partly sunny skies through the afternoon and that extended forecast takes Saturday into the upper 20s. There's that light snow chance Sunday right around the mid 20s, close to freezing Monday, 32 degrees. Then another round of colder air that will ride in Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. We slump back into the 20s and it'll be quiet and cold again through the end of next week and toward the final weekend in January. We'll see highs in the upper 20s to near 30 degrees, and we could go the better part of the next 10 days at or below freezing. And if we were to do that, that'd be the next 240 hours or more below 32 degrees. Deep, deep chill is here to stay.